Good afternoon, I'm talking with Jeff Skiles, and I uh, just want to ask a quick question. What's new with uh, the Young Eagles this year, and how can you make more accessible to the young kids, and, and then do some follow-up after that? Well, the Young Eagles has, has done some uh, great things just the last year or two that people don't know about, even some of their chapter members don't know about. Mm -hmm. For uh, 18 years, they're providing the Young Eagle ride, but then there really wasn't much after that. And I think even the, even the people at the EAA realize that. Mm -hmm. So they've developed a lot of uh, additional programs, follow-ons, to, uh, to the Young Eagle ride. For instance, you know, uh, the uh, Sporty's Pilot Shop has generously donated the Next Step program, which is a free uh, streaming ground school that you can do online, and the EAA is able to track that when you sign on. They send you reminder notices, how's it going as you go along. Once you uh, complete the ground school and uh, pass your written test, they'll actually give you a voucher for a free flight lesson so that you can go out to the airport and take your lesson. Once you pass the first phase of the ground school, you become eligible for, for grants, and, and they, have, uh, uh, they have a number of $1,500 grants that they'll give out in a year to help pay for flight training for the lucky people who, who win those. There are several $7,500 scholarships that the EAA provides uh, so that, uh, and, and it's uh, EAA donors, I should say. They have donors who are, are uh, you know, funding these for the EAA, but they have several scholarships that uh, children can apply for so that they can get their licenses. So there, there's quite a few programs that they've added. It's part of the what they call the, the EAA flight plan to really assist people, kids to uh, become, you know, uh, to an adult uh, aviation lifestyle, whether it be just as a hobby or, you know, even considering it for a profession. Mm -hmm. Is this opening up to older, uh, older youth or adults as well? Well, the program has always been for 8 to 17 year olds, mm -hmm. and it is still uh, at that for 8 to 17 year olds. They are, they are looking at, you know, uh, possibly some other things, but at this point, you know, that's all that they actually have programs for, and that is announced currently. Mm -hmm. And that's great. Well, thank you for coming to St. Louis, and hope to see you again soon. Well, thank you. Thank you.